all right guys welcome back so today we're going to be starting fallout 76 now um we've done a lot of Fallout on the channel in the past we started uh you know fallout 4 which is a weird game to start with but i started out uh fallout 4 then we went back we played fallout 3 new vegas and um now i'm here to check out a 76 now this game has gotten a lot of negativity anytime i've brought up you know fallout it always seems like fallout 76 has a lot a lot of negativity um surrounding it uh, a lot of people oh, games trash games trash uh, but then there's also a huge group of people that are saying hey man you know the game was pretty bad on launch but you know it's way different now or it's way better now um i never played the game on at, at launch this is actually my first time ever seeing this game ever um so i guess we you know we get to skip all that so if you guys are wondering if you heard back in the day you know fallout 76 was really bad uh you know is it better uh we're going to find out right now. We're, we're going to dive into it. So I know this game, I think it's on Game Pass. So if you have Xbox Game Pass, I'm pretty sure it's free on Game Pass. Uh, I'm playing it on PC currently. Uh, the game is multiplayer. Uh, you can play it with friends and stuff like that. And I also was told that you can still play it. It's still a single player game, but just there will, there's, a, a multiplayer element to it so it's not like i don't think it forces you into multiplayer we'll have to see we'll have to see how it goes guys because i have no clue um but there it is guys um let's get this fired up now i believe this takes place in virginia right or west virginia or something it was one of the virginias Uh, but again, everybody, I appreciate you. If you guys do want this to be a series, all you got to do is smash that like button. Uh, best way to let me know that you guys are actually enjoying it. You want to see more. Um, depending on how this goes, we might incorporate some multiplayer with the community. I might bring some of you guys in, allow you to play. Uh, but we're going to start off solo, just kind of get a feel for the game and then go from there. All right. Uh, new patch will add new stuff for players. I don't, I don't, I don't even know what you mean, Black Game. And I'm, I mean, I'm just playing whatever version's available. Never changes. In 1776, this great nation accepted that armed conflict was the only way to preserve our rights to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. If our founding fathers could only see us now. From Antietam to Amiens, Okinawa to Anchorage, we have fought. And now, the red menace is at our doorstep. Where are the subtitles? I Democracy turned them on. Democracy itself is under threat of annihilation. That is why today, July 4th, 2076, 300 years after our great nation began, we gather together to honor the completion of Vault 76. This sprawling underground shelter may have been engineered by Vault Tech, but it was built by you good people of America, so that if the bombs do come, if the end does come, our way of life will endure. But not everyone will be saved. Those chosen to enter this vault must be our best and our brightest. For when the fighting has stopped and the fallout has settled, you must rebuild. Not just walls, not just buildings, but hearts and minds, and ultimately, America. <laughs> they make it. They make the vaults look so like so as we like stand a like a party. Today, we pray that the world will know peace. But if that is not our destiny, if war must come, we stand together, knowing that here in Vault 76, our future begins. Not showing the reality of what it was really like to live in a vault. Good morning, Vault 76. 
six. This is the Overseer. I hope you all enjoyed the party last night, even those who may have overindulged and overslept. Okay, maybe, maybe they do party in this vault. Maybe Vault 76 is just different, guys. And get out there. We've been locked away long enough. All right, so uh, move the mouse, selected area to change. Is reclamation day. Um, let me see. It may be time to leave, but I'll never forget the day you all entered Vault 76. You come from every walk of life, every race, color, and creed. But you all share one very important trait. You are this country's best and brightest. But more importantly, oh, wow. so you can, like, you'll always be my family. Yeah, they got a decent bit of sculpting in this. And I, I'm really, really bad at, like, sculpting and shit, guys. It's, it's not my thing. Um, Like, <laughs> at all. I just want to try to see if I could get some there we go uh we can get damage M uh, makeup don't need markings get some scars going what was the dude there uh that uh that you chase out of um in fallout 4 the guy that we're pursuing there that's stole our son What's his name? Like, yeah, I might go with this. <clears throat> Old miner, radiation dust. Kel uh, Kellogg, Kellogg. They didn't, did he have a scar? I don't know. Maybe he didn't have a scar. Dude, can I not give myself a dope ass beard? Uh, body. You know we gotta be... Hey, we gotta be yoked. I wonder if, uh, so... Do, I wonder if it actually has any... Effect on your skills or whatever, depending on how big you are. Is it all just cosmetic? We'll find out. You have to edit face. Jaw, mouth, face lower. Try to find beard. Oh, here we go. We could change our complexion. I'll roll with that. I don't see beard, though. Forehead, eyes, hair. Oh, we could change our hair, though. Got the greaser, boot camp, balding, midlifer. <laughs> Why is that gotta be called the creeper, man? It's kinda like the hair that uh what's his face and GTA has. Trevor. So I guess I get it. I might just go with the... Or was it? Yeah, just that. That works. Alright, now let me see if we can... Let's see if we can actually get the beard. Mouth, jaw, chin, neck. Racial hair, there it is, I see it. Boom. Whoops. So yeah, you just gotta scroll over the face and then it allows you to choose. Leprechaun, Playboy, Hard Road, Lone Wanderer, Outdoorsman. That's a pretty good beard right there, guys. That's a pretty good beard. Uh, Southern, thank you, thank you for the super chat, brother. Excited to see how you like this. I uh, also want to join in the game later. If you'll be streaming in about five, I, I, I probably won't be streaming this in five hours. Uh, but today's episode, we're going to be starting off uh, solo, just kind of get a feel of the game. And then um, 
We'll go from there. Oh, look at the Arthur Morgan. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the survivalist guys. That, that's a, that's a hefty beard right there. All right, we'll roll with this. It's good enough. Our name is gonna be Brian. Uh, but depending on how this does, you know what I mean. If you guys want to see more, we're we're for sure gonna be doing. Oh, look at this. We got our little ID card. Oh, good enough. There we go. Okay, so sensitivity feels decent right now. Today's the day, everyone. Reclamation Day. We've been preparing for this moment for 25 years. We're ready. You're ready. America is waiting for us. So they're in the 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 uh, the vault for 25 years. Okay, it seems like it has a pretty big, pretty big map. Menu, settings, controls. Where can you toggle uh, sensitivity and stuff? Here we go. You said it was a magazine on my on my desk. Nothing I can grab. So this isn't like normal fall. Like you 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 usually start off and you're grabbing everything that's not nailed down. But it doesn't seem like we can really loot any of this stuff. Hey, Brian. Was just watching your Borderlands vid from yesterday. Oh, get a, get a, Kept wanting to give boy. you tips, but should have caught it live. Hope you keep it it. Uh, hey, Nick, Nico. Thank you, thank you, man. I really appreciate it. No, for sure. We're definitely going to be continuing that playthrough. Where the hell is my pit boy at, guys? Oh, there it is. It's like in the wall. Oh, uh, but Nico, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. And SR3 with the four months, another classic. I was hoping you'd try this. Yeah, for sure. I, I, it's been a long time coming, guys. It's been a long time coming. Uh, but here we are. So we got our, P, our pit boy. Okay, so it's normal setup like a regular pit boy. Um, no, everything looks the same as normal Fallout. Uh, we do got perks, strength, perception, endurance. Yeah, so we don't have any points in any of this stuff yet. Uh, Flashy, thank you. Thank you for the super chat, man. You will be uh, happy to know there are crossbows in Fallout 76. Enjoy it, man. Take your time and explore. This game is so worth it. Now I'm, I'm excited. And Southern, thank you so much for that membership. That is huge, brother. Hardened survivor, man. Okay, so they definitely had a big party when in here. This, it means I've been gone for several hours. I've got my own mission out there in Appalachia. This is the overseer signing off. Okay, you gotta uh, go tell mommy. I mean, not here. Message repeats. Okay, wait till she get back. When she gets back. Four hours. System break. So is this how all the vaults were supposed to be? They were supposed to throw like a big party or something before the before it was opened. 
Doesn't seem like there's anything really in here, though. Yo, this is a nice vault, man. Hello. At last. Today is your reclamation day. I bet you're just bursting your bolts to get out there and see the world. I guess so. Uh, do we know anything? Nothing any at all. The exterior sensors were taken out of commission after that unfortunate business with the nuclear bombs. With so many of your friends having been gone so long, I cannot begin to speculate how they've transformed Appalachia already. Excellent. Adventure and opportunity awaits you, sir. Thank you, Cottlesworth. The kiosks have valuable information to help you thrive out there. Best get cracking. Stay fed, stay hydrated. Yeah, this vault seems extra fancy. Oh, there we go. We got a stim pack and a right away. And you will get injured. Make use of stim packs. They are literal lifesavers. Okay. So, I think it said to push the equal sign. Was there a no? Yeah, yeah. Stage one here. Stay hydrated. So, we got water and radex. Okay, so clean water cycle, obtain water, find campfire, boil water, enjoy. Okay. Do I have blue eyes? No, no, no. My eyes are very, very dark. Uh, Ghidorah with the uh, with the super chat, man. Uh, remember, it's online. Uh, your pip boy won't stop time. You can get owned, so no cheeky life saves. I was never big on vats. Anyways, uh, if you watch <laughs> my previous Fallout playthroughs, uh, I was never a VATS user. I just I just played the game as an FPS. Uh, so, about the infrastructure out there in Appalachia, I suspect there isn't any. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, building supplies. Find a new home. Build a generator. Wire it up. Power. Um, join the team. Hey, Brian, remember oh, it's online. Your pip boy wants stop time. You can get owned, so no cheeky life saves. Again. Uh, meet strangers, exchange pleasantries, share skill sets, success. Ammo can be crafted at Tinker's Workbench. Equip armor by opening your pip boy, items, and armor. Oh, so uh, we do start off with weapons, though, guys. We have a uh, 10 millimeter pistol and a combat knife already. Okay, so what is this? Stop uh, pretending it's reclamation day, are we? Uh, Lore says that all the vaults were different social experiments. Gotcha. Well, this one was a damn good one, I'd tell you what. Uh, press V for third person. Oh, wow. I, I generally never played the Fallout games in third person because they, they they were very floaty and weird looking, but this actually looks quite good um, in third person. You do remember the whole point of Reclamation Day? Huh? Reclaiming Appalachia? Never too late. All right, so camping made easy. Um, setting up a camp. Find flat ground, drop your camp, use resources and build, survive in style. This seems like a whole lot of shit. I have no clue. So it said something about houses. Find a house. And then it also says campsites. What is there like, like semi like, cause I know Fallout 4 had um, base building and stuff like that, but it was like at the, 
at the encamp or the the camps there, like the settlements, you couldn't like randomly set one up anywhere. But can you like live anywhere in this game? Never stop learning. Be the best that you can be. Um, surprise. Not bats when you go into your inventory to say heal or eat. Oh, Gidor, I got you, brother. Got you. I'm gonna have to yeah get good at healing then, or just get good. Period. Thank you so much, but I really do appreciate the super chats, man. I wondered if I could um, hotkey that stuff. So there's a food and water, hunger and thirst. Remember one of Voltec's many, many mottos. Find your calling. Some perk cards. Mm, okay, so I don't know what is this like every uh, fall game where you get a bunch of different ability or uh, builds and stuff? Because you guys know me, I like my stealth builds. Agility is a measure of overall fitness and reflexes. It affects the uh, number of action points and vats, which I care less about, and your ability to sneak. Um. Resistance to disease, perception or awareness of nearby enemies, ability to detect stealthy movements, and uh, your weapon accuracy in vats, and then strength is a measure of your raw power. It affects how much you can carry and the damage of melee attacks. Let me see what my carrying capacity is, because early on, especially when you're trying to make money and stuff like that, and you're hitting all those different sites, uh, so we can hold 155. I might get, I might throw a couple points into strength early on, just so we can carry a bit. Uh, the camp is a mobile settlement workbench. You can live anywhere. Also, weapons and armor degrade, so you'll need to repair them from time to time. Got you. Fleshy, thank you, thank you, man. I really appreciate it. <clears throat> All right, we're going to go. Oh, here we go. What is this? Pick a perk. Gladiator. Your one-handed melee weapons now do 10% damage. Okay. I wonder how effective melee is in this game. There were some pretty cool melee builds um, that you could do in. Uh... Some may call them jobs, but I like to think of them as perks. Right. So I didn't miss anything else in here, right? I got the campsite. What is this? Oh, those are just more little campfires. Got a hot wheel there. Lock, punch. How do you equip weapons? Weapons, we've got our 10 millimeter. Okay, so press. Yeah, like I said, the third person actually looks quite good. Uh, left all is a power attack. Okay, so it's just a melee attack while you have this equipped. Actually got a ton of ammo, 200 rounds? Go follow the waypoints to the terminal. Oh, is that what that little... Oh, 
discover what the overseer's mission is. I see what you're saying. Yeah, I thought that this waypoint was trying to bring me outside. Yeah, I'm quite curious what the overseer's mission even was. Heck of a party last night, eh, sir? Good to see you all together one last time. Drunk, joyous, and not staving off on horrible death minute by minute. Overseer's eyes only. After Reclamation Day, you are personally ordered to find and secure three nuclear silos. Codename Alpha Bravo Charlie. If these sites are still nuclear capable, ensure no one except vault can access or launch nuclear ordnance. Um, to be clear, even if there are uh, other authorities, whether government militia, their claims are to be ignored. vault alone maintains jurisdiction. Got it. Vault 76, one of the most important projects that vault has completed. No expenses has been villain staffing, selecting the inhabitants of the vault. So this was like, yeah, like the cream of the crop. Here in Vault 76, Americans have been chosen, including uh, limitations from Vault Tech University, or alumni, uh, the special class, the instructions you received managing the vault do not apply. Your mission is to see the livelihood and well being of your colony. Road. Pretty much their job was to re secure nuclear dominance after the. after uh, everybody got released. You'll face challenges, you haven't been prepared for to adapt operational procedures. Yeah, let's play the hollow tape. Overseer's log, or should I say, direct communication. Because whoever is listening to this had the moxie to try to find out where I've gone. But I'm glad you did. Truth is, I need your help. I've been given a task, and I've decided to break protocol and tell you what it is. Because if there's one thing I've learned in these past few years, it's that we need to rely on each other. There were three active nuclear silos in Appalachia before the bombs fell. They blew up the world before. We can't let it happen again. So we've got to locate and secure all of the silos. Or die trying. Hopefully the former. But it's been 25 years. I just don't know what we're gonna find out there. Or where to start. My directive was to go to the nearest population center and assess the situation. I'll set up a camp on the way once I get my bearings. Find me there. Pretty simple, straightforward. Good thing is, is uh, we killed all of the, uh, the death claws in Fallout 4, so we shouldn't have to worry about death claws anymore. Right? Uh, Crockett's with the 10 months. Thank you so much. Cryptic, how you doing today, brother? Glad to see you back in the vault. So happy to be a part of the Menard family. And thank you all the member donors for my monthly membership. Hey, brother, we appreciate you being here. All right, let's 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 do it, guys. Let's not waste no more time. Whoa. So bright. Wait, this game takes place before Fallout? For what? Okay, the wayward. Let's get this map up. Oh wow, it just like shows like players on the map. He 
people set up camps and shit like that. Okay, so what is my mission? Speak to Pentagon. Oh, sir, those young ladies down there, they seem exceedingly alive. They haven't yet made any untoward advances, but perhaps you could speak to them? Verify their intentions are civil? Only that they appear to have some vested interest in accessing the vault. One seemed quite perturbed when I told them that wouldn't be happening. But I'm not sure if she believed me. I've been keeping watch here long enough to have learned that outside the vault, people don't always have one's best intentions at heart. I'm sorry to say it, but it's the truth. Until quite recently, it's been exceedingly peaceful. I maintained my post, greeted latecomers out of the vault, and otherwise reveled in Appalachia's natural splendor. I was gonna say, this place but looks wicked recently, nice. It seems people have come back to Appalachia. Those two and more to boot. The non-vault sort, you understand. It's all very concerning. Who knows what they might be up to? Well, yes, but it's been some time. But she was a resourceful woman. I, I'm, I'm sure she's all right. Pat with the 16 months. Thank you so much. Oh, do be careful out there, sir. All right, so we got two... Two ladies. Uh, they don't seem particularly aggressive, so we might be all right. Teammates, thank you for the five gifted, brother. Everybody receives one of those. Welcome to the family. And uh, Devin, with the two months, I sent you a DM with a link uh, in a game called Operator. Yeah, I see. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll check that out eventually. Like I said, I, I got about 100,000 games on my list to be checked out. So, um, you know what I mean? It's it, it's hard to. I don't And I don't prioritize anything. It's all. They all go relatively in order for the most part. Whoa, whoa. Just a friend here, not a threat. Just had some questions for you. You came out of the vault, right? I thought it was empty. Wait, is the door still open? I'll be streaming another game later, yep. My partner and I need a way into that vault. We got a tip from the Wayward. Heard of the place? A new bar down the road. So this guy told us that after you gave him the last of our caps. And he said that inside that vault is the, you know, that's where the big one is. Our last chance to turn our lousy luck around. The big one? You know, the thing that brought everyone back. The treasure. But I told you, Lacey, the guy was scamming us. That's just a vault. Those were the last of our caps. No, someone has to know something. We're just going to stick it out until we find them. Wonderful. Thanks for answering some questions for us, I suppose. Seems only fair I return the favor. Anything we can answer for you? Uh, you won't have any spare weapons with you. What else can you tell me about this treasure? What can you tell me about the area? About Appalachia? Other than it's a graveyard? There's that. 
We haven't been How's really this long? game? I may buy it. I'll together. let you play it more though, smiley the face. got hit pretty hard. Not long after. Well, these things showed up. The scorched. They're merciless. They seem to have cleaned up whoever the bombs might have missed. Without people around, everything else has gone haywire. Chris, thank you so much for the super chat. Yeah, I mean, we just started. I, I don't, I don't have an opinion yet. I mean, if right now it just feels like a Fallout game. They so. Sent you out here without a weapon? Be a quick trip trying to do this unarmed. Here. Oh, she actually got. Oh, they gave us a machete. Nice. Happy to tell you what I know, which isn't much. Someone made a broadcast not too long back about there being some kind of treasure buried in Appalachia. We don't know what. We don't know where. But with people as desperate as they are, it's meant everyone with a functioning radio has come back to try and see if they can get a piece of it. Monsters or no? Guy we met at the Wayward. Carter, I think was his name? He gave us a couple of leads to chase down in exchange for all our money. Up to us now to make something of them. Hmm. If your overseer crossed our path, she sure wasn't broadcasting it. Sorry. You might ask at the wayward. Seems like they set themselves up to be a natural stopping point. Okay, so the the wayward is uh Watch yourself out there. Seems like where we need to be. Oh, Mac515, what's up, dude? Oh, you could trade with people? Okay, so combat knife, I want to swap. So I got a machete now. Handgun. So how do you know if they're hostile or not? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna assume everything's hostile. Yeah, we got some 10 millimeter rounds for that. So food and water and stuff, we're gonna need that. I seen those blue flowers. I don't know what these flowers are for. I'm just going to grab them anyways. Oh, so the players are just like in the world? Oh, I didn't know it was like this, guys. This is like... Almost like an MMORPG style. But it's kind of like like, like like a GTA or something like that. Like, Anderson, thank you, thank you, man. How you doing, brother? Thank you for the super chat, man. Ooh, psycho. What was the one that I took in Fallout 4 that would, like, slow down time or whatever? Jet. Yeah, Jet was pretty awesome in Fallout 4. If we could expand our area all the way out here, the Raiders don't have a chance.
Okay, so we're just on our way to Wayward right now, which is... Right here. Like I said, I'm just looting up these flowers. I don't know. I don't know if I'll be able to use them for anything. But if anything, we could sell them, right? But yeah, this this area is gorgeous, man. Like, you're used to like all the Fallout games. Generally, when you get out, they're they're wastelands. You know what I mean? This is quite a different vibe. Almost like uh, the forest mod. That we installed. Remember uh, when I played Fallout? If, for those of you guys that were here when I played Fallout 4, I had the the forest mod, and it made everything all green and uh, a lot of vegetation and shit like that. The food and water meter seems to be last in a long ass time. I haven't. Had a drink or eat anything at all. But it's like they incorporated some of the uh, survival mod um, into this one. All right, let's keep moving. Investigate the corpse at the isolated cabin. I do gotta admit the third person um, character animations are so much better than previous fall games. They were, they were so bad in the for previous fall games. I just I couldn't play the games in third person like that. I didn't, I don't know. I didn't like it. What is that? Fire camp. Wait, this is the wayward? Oh no, okay. I was like, dude, what? The it's down that way. I'm looting everything, hoping that it's it's like the other follow games where you can just sell everything. Oh shit, we got a dead uh, vault dweller. Uh, Ruben safe key. Distract him, stash the rest of his supplies, jump in the crate. Pray to God I survive. Find anyone from 76. Kill Zach. Need more materials to keep building into the shelter. Wood, steel, screws, gears, copper. Go. Uh, fusion cells, golf club. Three more money. Got it. Assault Viper, thank you, brother, for the super gem. Or, or the gifted, brother. I appreciate it. Uh, can you read notes on the wall? Oh, these? Cool note. My name is William Keller. I represent a group of brave men and women who you may wish to meet. In the years since our new lives began, many of us have begun to lose things we once took for granted. Our skin, a face, an old voice. Most painfully, each of us have lived to see our friends and loved ones die around us. Oh yeah, because ghouls are immortal, right guys? Or they pretty much live forever, or at least a really long time. It's been 20 years, no one should have to suffer in loneliness and fear. You are not alone. If you're interested in meeting a group of our neighbors has gathered to the east, we've been uh, contacted by a larger community like ours living in the capital. Apparently the city was hit hard, but they say a society is beginning to grow there. We're considered joining them. WK. 
So we did just find a key, though, on the, the vault uh, person's body. Taking all this stuff. Oh, Flashy, thank you, thank you for the gifted brother. Or the, the super chat, man. Um, in fact, Fallout 76 incorporated my custom survival mod. Advanced needs, Fallout 4 here. Use people's mods as well as improve the game. Got you. Yeah, it seems like... Uh, um, so drinking this water here, is it clean? Nope, okay, yeah, that gives us... Get, get a little bit of rads from that water. Uh, weapon workbench. Oh, so there's a workbench here. Uh, we can scrap items. We can modify and repair. Nineteen damage. Speed medium. I was also crafting. So we can craft blunt melee weapons, a board, uh, edged melee weapons, combat knife, hatchet, machete, pipe guns. So pipe pistol, pipe bolt action pistol, pipe revolver, and syringer, and then throwing weapons, throwing knives. And then we can also scrap items. I'll, I'll worry about that later on once we look more into crafting, and then I want to look at upgrading and modifying so we can add, oh, the receivers, the barrels, the grips, uh, the magazine. Do muzzles. Okay. So it's kind of like, it's, it's just like Fallout 4 when it comes to um, weapon customization. For the most part, that's at least what it looked like. It's gonna take some getting used to, like they're just being like players and shit. Oh, what is that? Okay, so it was a pet. Um, the main difference in uh, weapon crafting is you have to scrap guns to unlock mods for it. Got you. Yeah. What, did you catch it? All right, hold on. Let me check my weight. Okay, so we still got plenty of inventory left. Is that a cat? Cheswick too. Yeah. Every night there's more of them. Brotherhood warned them, warned us all. Defiance has fallen, they said. What the hell does that mean? Supplies are running low. May try to get the Abbey. Free state. Gotta get more. Sammy, read this. Get the Abbey straight east with the Red Rocket Megastop. 
Oh, she knows the Brotherhood of Steel better than anyone. Ooh, there it is, guys. Oh, as you guys know, I'm a member, certified member of the Brotherhood of Steel. So I'll take it the Brotherhood's obviously in this game. It better be. I just got myself a pipe long pistol or something. Oh yeah, pipe bolt action pistol. Damage 40. And it shoots a 308 round. So it seems like this hits way harder than the 10 millimeter. Uh, Christina, thank you. Thank you for the super chat. I do appreciate it. I really enjoy your state of decay vids. I learned a lot from your videos. I listen to your videos. While I work. Hey, I'm really glad I could help you out. Yeah, SOD is uh, definitely where it's at. Uh, but I appreciate you being here. So this is what? Oh, uh, this is an armor station. So I got a little bit of resources. I could actually craft some of this. So can I scrap some stuff into... Um, yeah, it tells you right here. So that will give me glass. We need leather. Yep, right here. So I could scrap that in a leather. Let me see if we have anything else I can scrap in a leather. Ceramics. Let me scrap all junk. Which was pretty much everything I picked up. So do I already have all right, I already have a leather chest piece on um, So I'll go ahead and craft Okay so we got the left le leather arm. And I'll do the right arm. Okay, so is that? Yep, that's that's as simple as that. So you just craft up armor pieces. Pretty sure there's probably a lot more uh, to it than that, but I got myself some basic armor. These are so weird, man. All right, let me head to Wayward. Okay, so that's what the key unlocks. Definitely not doing that. Uh, so, those of you guys are wondering, this game is free on Game Pass. What if, uh... Let's see, I should probably try to farm... Yo, the 308 hits.
take that and uh, craft up some more leather with it, with the hide. Oh, there's uh, the water pumps. Crane treasure. What the hell is this? Oh, is this somebody's base? Here we are, the wayward. Anything you need's inside. Okay, uh, team only interior, private area that is unique to your character. Only you and your teammates can be in this interior. Friends and strangers can't join you. Make important story choices that have large consequences. Progress is saved less frequently when in a solo interior. Be sure your quest has been checkpointed before leaving. Gotcha. This isn't kind of stealing, right? It doesn't say steal, so I forget. Maybe I will paint the walls with you if you don't tell me where Crane's treasure is right now. Sweetheart, I think you must be sick, because pointing a gun at me in my own bar is a terminal affliction. Look around. You think I'm having my people piece this place together out of mobile homes because I'm thrifty? Do I look like I know where this treasure is? Shut up! You got ten seconds to tell me where Crane is! Ten... Don't do nine, this, son. Eight... Seven... Fine. Six... Suit yourself. Five, Mort, you busy four, dog? three, two. Don't shoot the ghoul. He's with us. All right. Well, lady, listen. Hope you understand. I saved your life, right? Well, not exactly the introduction to the wayward I would have hoped for. Well, sorry about that, darling. First round's on me. Name's Duchess. There's something I could do for you. Your guess is as good as mine, sweetheart. He busted in here saying I needed to turn over the location of some fellow named Crane, who I guess I must have served at some point or another. Since then, a steady stream of miscreants has been making my life irritating. Not exactly good for a budding business. Now that you mention it, I could use an extra pair of hands. See? That boy you put down. He's not the first of his crew to roll in here. But I want him to be the last. Normally, I'd send my people out to clean house. But my muscles run off, so I don't have the bodies to spare right now. But I'm willing to pay good money if you put an end to this for me. Say so, less. What do you say? Um. Only see. seems fair. The details, then. Now, each of these boys came in asking after Crane. I'm thinking we can make that work for us. How would you grab the attention of a bunch of single-minded thugs? Mail invitation. 
That's what my mom did for my birthday parties. Thought I guess. <laughs> um. Oh, darling. Um, see, as fine as that idea is, you know, I was thinking we could take a different tack. Just give me one second. She didn't like my idea? Of course, Brian's going to be a raider? Wait, what do you mean? You could... I could... You could... Uh, okay, I think I'll just... Uh, I just want you to know... How can you play exactly this game? Forte. Huh, not half bad. So what I have chicken scratched together here for you is the schematic for one custom-made Crane Treasure Hunting Inc. sign. If I didn't butcher the plans too bad, it's got a little system built in that'll make sending out an advertisement and getting this gang's attention a snap. You just need to build it, use the tape it spits out to tell the world you're open for business, and then convince any punks that show up to tell you where their boss is hiding. They did teach you all how to build from schematics up in that vault of yours, didn't they? That's the spirit. Hey, if you need a refresher, good old Morty Mort can help you out. What are you on about, Mordecai? Hey, nah, I'm not bragging or anything, but I've got some tapes that cover that very subject. Oh, Mort, not the tapes. Well... You find yourself wanting a refresher? Talk to Mort. Of course you're okay. gonna need materials, but we should have enough lying around to cover you there. Get you together a little care package. Throw some rations in there too, so you don't starve on me. And so you know, you might have to break some of this scrap down for parts, but I can spot you some workbench materials too, since you're doing me such a big one. Who knows? Maybe you'll learn something while you do it. Now, you ready to get this show on the road? Let's do it. Oh, uh, I did want to ask. You haven't seen him. Yep. Overseer, huh? So you must be the one. <laughs> no, I haven't seen her. But I have heard her. My people found a tape just on the other side of the road that it seems she left behind for one of her dwellers. Though it's a bit out of date now. Maybe it was waiting there for you. Happy to give it to you, so long as you're still willing to help us. Let's do it, guys. Hot dog. Be good to have those dolts off our back at long last. Just make sure, once you find out where they're hiding, that their leader gets the message. The wayward gets left alone. And here, that overseer tape. Sounds like she set up that camp across the way so her people could get some practice in self-reliance. Probably worth looking into if you think you could use a refresher. Okay, awesome. So we got a bunch of stuff that popped up that we needed. Guys, I should probably go on the other side. Yeah. Blocking less on that side than I am on this side. Um, so I got her vi or her tape. Let me see data. What do you listen to tapes? Here we go. Overseer's log. South of Vault 76. I, I knew this wasn't going to be the Appalachia I remembered, but... Mutated animals? Haywire bots? And no people so far. We have to be ready to rebuild in... What I can confirm is... Hostile territory. Fortunately, Vault Tech was prepared. You see this? The cooking station, the stash box, the workbenches, all built with the camp. You need a home base out there. The construction and assembly mobile platform is designed to give you one. Just add resources, planning, 
and a little elbow grease. When you move your camp, everything you've built is stored, ready to be placed back down in the new area. Use this to establish a foothold whenever you're in unfamiliar territory. I've left my camp behind so you can use it. I know I'm breaking my own advice by not taking it with me. But after seeing Appalachia for myself, I need to make sure every resident of 76 has a safe haven they can start from. I'll make do without it. If it's still standing, the town of Flatwoods is further down this road. Find me there. This is the Overseer. Signing off. All right, we'll, we'll worry about following her later on. But the, we got to do this one. Do these missions. All right, so we'll talk to Morty here real quick. See what he has to say about Glad building. Glad to hear vault Tech actually took care of some of their people. You hear these rumors, right, about him just throwing folks to the wolves. Here's some rations and a fancy suit. Good luck. Well, don't you worry that smooth little face of yours. You are in good company now. Because around here, we look after one another. Now, what can I do for you? Guys, I want to thank you. We already got over 400 likes on the stream. I really, really appreciate it. I'm so excited to get into this. Um, like I said, right now, it just feels like your traditional uh, fall game definitely has some like the building is it, the camp stuff is is new. I'm I'm pretty interested to see what this is gonna be like, uh, but so far it's it's pretty dope. Uh, four minutes till the storm hits. Oh yeah, yeah guys, we got a bad storm incoming. So if I like lose power or something, um, that that's why. Just so you guys know. Uh, unique, thank you, thank you for the ten months. I really appreciate you. Okay. Um. Listen, friend, you happen to be talking to the exact right person to fix your predicament. But if I'm going to help you, I want something in return. All right, listen, I got this plan. You're going to help me get rich. See, the folks who made it big off the gold rush, they weren't the prospectors. They were the folks that sold them their shovels. Now, I don't do shovels. What I collect is knowledge. I can go all sorts of places you folks with your rad sucking skin can't. So, I'm selling what I've got between my ear holes, and you're gonna test it for me. I made these hollow tapes. Now this sets all the info I dug up about that camp doohickey you bolters got. All I'm asking is you give them a listen and let me know what you think. You will? Oh, thank you. I mean, <clears throat> thanks. Just come back once you've taken them out for a test drive. Now, is there anything else you wanted to chat about? Okay, so we got placing your camp added, and we got building your camp, powering your camp. So we got three different um, tapes. Some other time then. All right, let's get out, get this camp going. Even with the, the just a little beginning bit he's doing, those NPCs. Wait, the NPCs were in the game when you guys first played this? When this game first came out? So this was the overseer's old camp here. So can I just, I can just piggyback off this one or should I, or do I got to do my own? Cause this one has everything. Okay. So read the plane crash treasure on this guy's inventory. Oh. Here we go. This is the one I want. Place your camp. Hello? Hello. This is Mort McCoy. And welcome to the first of Headmaster.
Master Mort's Edu Tapes. Today we're talking about your camp. Now, former Vault resident or someone who killed a Vault resident, let's start off with the basics. Placing your camp. When plugging down your camp, C-A-M-P, that's an acronym, for the first time, remember to Remember to take the lay of the land. Consider the grade of the terrain, general defensibility and proximity to your surroundings. Could that cliff edge be used to protect your flank? You bet your chops it could. Once you've found the perfect spot, it's time to move on to the best part of working with your camp. Construction! Let's wait, you can't hold V to start building. Construction can be an intricate process. So a steady hand and an eye for detainment <clears throat> details. Damn, I had to get that one up. An eye for details are a must. You should take a moment to familiarize yourself with the camp's patented intuitive construction interface. But don't worry. We'll cover construction in court. Oh, let's, yeah, let's get one of these. Of Headmaster Mort's edutapes. So long. Come on, what's that? Okay, so it said to, to push Z, but when I push Z, it doesn't do anything. I wonder if it's because this is not a suitable area to, to build a camp. I don't know. I'm just going to use the camp here. All right, I'm going to craft this this weapon here, this stringer or whatever it is, this. Okay, so I crafted a new ranged weapon. I don't know what ammo that one uses, though. Let's check that. I got a bunch of pipe pistols. Got the pipe wrench. Where is it? Where the hell did I get this laser pistol from? Oh, it's a syringer. So, yeah, this shoots syringes of some sort. I don't know what kind of syringes, but it shoots syringes. All right, and now it says, um, read the plane crash treasure hunting sign schematic in your inventory. Here we go. Okay, so these are... Okay, so I read the two schematics there. Uh, build a crane treasure hunting sign at my camp. Tons of goodies in here. Holy crap, guys. Oh, is it because it's not my stash? Oh, that's my inventory? Wait, I have all the... Where did I get arrows from? Oh. So how do I store stuff? I'm sitting here like, yo, I didn't, I don't remember having any of this stuff. Where the hell did I get arrows from? Bro, get out of my camp, bro. This is my camp. Oh, 
look at that. The ranger armor. All right, um, I'll, I'll do some leg, the leg armor if I have enough. Yep, we got enough. Okay, that was leg left. Then leg right. Okay, so now I should have full-blown leather armor. Perfect. Now, it says to build the... Check the crooked station here, see what we can do. I can choose my own campsite. That's what I'm probably gonna go look. So right here I could I can make the moot fruit juice or the mutt how do you pronounce that guys? Is it moot or mutt fruit? Boiled water, uh soup flour and wood. Do a couple of these. Now it says um, to build the crane treasure at my camp. Do I need a work uh, a, a bench that I don't have? Actually, let me go. Let me go try to build my own camp somewhere, guys. I want to see how that works. Mute fruit. Gotcha. See somebody built one here. This is a good spot, man. So what the hell is the button to... The place to camp. Do I need to use that little campsite majiggy thingy? Uh, this thing? Where was it? That little campsite thing I picked up at the... Scrap kit, key ring, bubble pin, no. You sure you want to place your kid? Got. Okay, so the, and then. I also got a level, guys. Action points regenerate. Uh, Fallen by 20 breath oh, automatically uses them. That's not bad. Good work. Oh, 
And then I, I don't think I added it. There we go. Okay, so what the hell is this? Um, oh, this is the sign I had to learn, right? So what do we want here? Um, could do flooring, walls, roofs, stairs, doors, crafting. Here we go. So we're going to go ahead and get... Get this set up. Well, they had... I guess I'll just build one of we'll build one of everything. This this campsite's not the best location. Like I'm kind of like sitting here looking at this area and I'm like, uh But uh, I think I could pick up my camp and move it, right? Like I, I didn't pick a very good spot. I know this guys. But it's okay for right now. Uh we got the so load the broadcast tape into the radio tower. And activate the connection. Where is that? Okay, so radio tower is up here. We'll make our way up there. This, yeah, it seems like you can put the camp anywhere. I picked a really shit... Ooh. Are those hostiles? Feral ghouls. Need power for the sign to work. I mean, I probably got to get a generator or something going. Should have used that other campsite. Okay, that's just a scavenger. They're not red, though. Here we go. Let's get down low here. down there. Now, is this the... I feel like I'm not going the right way. to be up this way though. Okay, so that guy is not hostile. He's not red, so we should be okay, right? 
Oh, hold on one sec, guys. Hold on one sec. The responders need you visit the church in the town of Flatwoods. Food, shelter, security. under the protection of the responders. Sorry about that, guys. Been waiting for that phone call all day. And of course, it would come through when I'm working, right? Okay, so there's NPCs all over the place, and not all of them are bad, so... Oh, look at that town down there, guys. What is that? Oh, that's Flatwood. Okay, so that's the, the one where we gotta go to continue the main story. Alright, that's a Mr. Farmhand. Mysterious quills. Grab the high. Oh, grab all that. Is that a player wearing power armor? Guys, can you join? The, I know you guys said you could be a raider. Can you be a, a member of the Brotherhood of Steel? Damn. That's pretty sick, man. Now, did they do power armor? Like, because uh, I loved, I, I know some people weren't a fan of it. I loved the way power armor was in uh, Fallout 4. It really felt like, like, like you know, something that you got into. Or did is it is it like in Fallout 3 in New Vegas where you kind of put it on as armor, like pieces? Okay, so these guys are Scorched level 3. Same as 4? Okay, that's cool. This gun is so accurate. Hit him. Oh, shit. You're looking at me out here saving power armor, dude. So the thing is, is that the, um, the pipe pistol hits hard, the 308, but the problem with it is that slow reload is just, it's too much, man.
had it. I just got some free stims. Alright, so load the broadcast tapes into here. Let's do it. So we want broadcast tape. Activate. Message uploaded. Initiating broadcast pulse. Attention all consumers. New business established. Please seek out Crane Treasure Hunt Incorporated to exchange goods and services. Initiate tagline. Follow the sign to fortune. Broadcast complete. Well, now, now they're going to be coming, guys. Crazy thing is, this guy's got, like, some top-tier power armor. Why is he in this area? Got like a jetpack. Just casual flexing. Oh, he might be out here farming. Got you. So I got a little bit of radiation. Nothing crazy, but... So I thought about removing it, but I don't have much uh, anti-radiation stuff, so we're going to hold off. Okay, wait to see who the sign draws in. So we're literally just sitting here chilling, guys, waiting. Uh, it said I had access to healing cells. Yeah, right here. Ray, you here? Yeah, up here, dude. Get out the water, you weirdo. You're not Crane. What the hell's going on here? <laughs> Where's your gang? Tell me or I'll eat your eyeballs. Crane found the treasure. Holy shit. Where is he? Probably not much more than you. 
He came to Appalachia, not far back, hunting for the same treasure everyone else is. Last time I saw him, he mentioned something about an abandoned storage facility he'd picked up some details on, but beyond the general, he didn't share. Now, your turn. Where is he? The uh, wayward, huh? It might be I pay the place a visit. Appreciate the tip, not Crane. Oh, fuck, dude. Good luck out here. We got to remember that the, the, the NPC pathing is based off of where I built my base. <laughs> and I just happened to build my base here, so that's why they're walking around in the water and shit. Crane? This it? Thought you were some kind of big shot. So, rumor is you've got information our boss wants. You tell me where this treasure is, and he's willing to leave you alone. Scout's honor. How about you just tell me where the treasure is, and if I like what I hear, I'll tell you where you can hand in your application. You think we're idiots? The only thing in 76 are a bunch of wimpy, soft-shelled rich kids that got to nap away the apocalypse. Now, start flapping. Yeah, he didn't care. Or things are gonna get messy. Wish I had charisma too, man. We gotta get our way out of this. It's in DC, dude. Machete actually did some freaking damage, guys. Last spotted the wayward sex male. Build middle. Dangerous. Allegedly not, but be careful. First person to get him uh, to give up the location of the treasure gets a share of the overall take. West Virginia Lumber Co. There it is. Unopened perk pack? So I still don't quite understand the perks. So what do you find? Use two cards to create 
higher rank cards. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I don't really, I, I don't truly understand the, the card systems yet. All right, so they're at the lumber mill. The things we saw on the way here. I appreciate it. Oh, we can also trade with her, too. Well, you don't look too worse for wear. You managed to figure out where those miscreants are hiding? Yeah, I need a rifle, though. Um... What if I decided to work with for this gang instead of you? Dude. Fantastic. So that's where their boss will be. You just need to... Wait, wait West Virginia lumber? <laughs> that is not right. You misheard them for sure. And that's of concern. Why, exactly? Was wandering up that way not too far back. The lumber company? That place was overrun with a bunch of those big green bastards. Mutants. You've seen those Frankensteins. If this gang was able to clean those things out of the mill, Duchess, these guys might be tougher than advertised. Hmm. You got any recommendations on how you'd proceed? Well, I wouldn't go in guns blazing, unless you got some big guns. Could try and luck your way inside, maybe see if they want to talk to you. But there was this family I ran into up that way that I'm sure has had to deal with them already. There was also this, uh, let's say, special scrapper who was making some pretty bold claims about his knowledge of the mill. Wouldn't be a bad idea to check in with either of them. Okay. You'll find them at Anchor Farm if these thugs haven't already run them off. But if they are still there, well, they probably managed to work something out with them. Hey, it couldn't hurt to find out what it was. Found him living in the stalls at Tyler County Fairground. Guy kept claiming he knew the best way to run the mutants out of the mill. But listen, I couldn't get him to spill how. Probably have a better chance he'll share what he learned with someone who still has an entire face. Well, that's a good thing, because that's all I've got. If you haven't already explored up that way, the fastest route back would be via Vault 76 and trekking north from there. And take care of yourself, all right? You're doing us a big one here. So I just got an overall arch. I just got to kill the gang leader. Now it's up to me how to do it. Uh, so kill the gang leader or convince the gang leader to leave the wayward alone. Optional, I can question the family at the farm. I could speak to the scrapper. I gotta know, having played all the ACs, do you think you could go back to the older games after the last three? I'm struggling with Brotherhood. Uh, Dagon, probably not, honestly. Uh, probably not. It, it definitely would be tough. And uh, thank you guys. We got over 500 likes on the stream. I really, really appreciate it. Um, and Miss uh, Bredich, how are you doing today with the three months? All right, let me uh, untag that other mess mission too. Yeah. I'm definitely enjoying the game so i mean it just feels like fallout to me
I mean, does it feel any different uh, than than any other game? You know, you start off at a vault, you make your way to your town, you start doing missions. I don't know where all the negative stuff comes in. Okay, so I can fast travel back to Vault 76. I don't know how that works. What? How am I hitting? There we go. Uh, so how do you fast travel? doesn't it doesn't even say they said uh the mission said uh optional fast travel back to vault 76 but i didn't see it Yeah, I clicked on the icon. It didn't. Oh, there we go. Maybe I didn't click on the icon. I think I tried to right click on the icon. Is there a way to holster your weapons? It's weird running around at the high ready. Responder corpse. So I want to check the um, so mantis increase intelligence. The mantis uh, increase perception and intelligence by two for five minutes. Also make you more thirsty. Psycho increases damage and damage resistance. Makes you hungry and thirsty. Got right away, stim packs. Okay, so Psycho's still pretty good. So we'll just follow this road down. This is the family. And that's the scrapper. And that's actually where the gang leader. So boom, boom, boom. All right in a row. But there's 10 millimeters putting in work, guys, on these little robot dudes. I'm just saying. how vats works in this game how do you even activate vats doesn't really matter to me because like i said i never use that using cells i also got that laser pistol too
A random dude with the membership. Welcome to the family. Over here, loot goblining it up, chat. I can't, I can't help it, but not try to loot everything. These little robots give good freaking resources. But yeah, guys, I, I do appreciate all of you guys coming and hanging out and showing love. Uh, remember, like I said, if you do guys, want, if you want this to be a series, all you got to do is smash that like button. Uh, also, let me know in the comments if you guys are watching this after the fact what you guys thought. Because uh, it is definitely, uh, I was expecting a lot worse, if I'm being honest. Like, from whatever, how people made it seem, like, I, was, I, I thought within the first, like, hour or so, I was going to be like, oh, this game is pretty trash but like I said it just feels like a fallout game feels good like I said this is just the beginning it improved dramatically since the initial release and and that's the thing though is, is people don't tell you that when when people when I, like when I ask people about hey you know I'm interested in playing fallout 76 Oh, that game's trash, dude. That game's fucking butt. Like, don't play it. It's, it's broken. It's this, it's that. People tell you that, that that's what I hear. You know what I mean? They don't say, oh, yeah, dude, the game was bad when it first came out. But, you know, it's much better now. No, like, barely anybody says that. Something's out there. Vice. Forty-five stim pack pipe revolver. I gotta be careful though, cause I'm almost yeah. Inventory is super heavy. The multi-purpose axe has thirty damage. Machete is nineteen. So this multi-purpose axe is actually a better melee weapon. Then a machete. Pipe pistol is trash. Pipe revolvers, all right. So the pipe revolver, this is what shoots 45. Yeah, I, I can move my camp, right guys? Like say I wanted to like, like, let me see. So I wanted to set up camp right here. Can you, can you just move that shit anywhere? And then what I just, I just build again? Get this. Uh... So we'll build the weapons workbench real quick. See if we can do some. So I remember you guys saying that your weapons break down.
So I'm going to scrap all junk real quick. Okay, so my, my weapon condition is great. I got two combat knives, so I'm going to start breaking down the extras. So we get raw rubber, um, steel scrap. Or pipe pistols. I'll keep the best condition one. Pipe revolver. Wood right leg. You guys, you can make wooden armor, guys. Okay, so you don't really get anything for breaking this stuff down. actually want to see about modifying now if we can modify our 10 millimeter okay so I don't have any now how do you get mods for for the, for the guns Oh, here we go. So this one, I could do uh, standard long barrel, snub barrel. So this just increases the range, but lowers the VATS accuracy and also the overall condition of the gun. I want to get my, we'll get the long barrel on there. Standard grip, standard mag. Could get the reflex dot. We need nuke materials and aluminum. Um, you gotta buy them or scrap other guns like it. Got you. Well, I was able to get a new barrel. Um, barrel on my uh, ten millimeter. I don't know which one I like more, guys. I, I, I like the game a lot in third person, and I also like the game a lot in first person. Would you guys say melee is viable in uh Farm is, I think, right here, right? In uh, 76. Oh, there's one of those uh, Fallout or uh, New Vegas robots. Melee is definitely viable. I mean, I used I, it worked out pretty well in that fight there. But the problem is when the guys have guns, um, you got to kind of like tank their shots until you close the distance. Run a sneak melee build. See, that's what I want. I want to. I want. I definitely want to run a stealth build. Ooh. Come on, dude! Don't make me kill your dog, bro.
I don't want to hear guys that dog came at me I, I don't know why they had to make it all savage when I killed it I didn't even kill it all that savage but the game obviously had to make it seem way worse than it was always setting me up man there's some bullshit Miguel with the super chat, another one bites it. No, come on, guys. That was not even my fault. <laughs> Those are mole rats. Oh, I didn't I didn't loot that guy's body. Short hunting rifle. There we go, guys. See, that's what I've been looking Yeah, now we got something with a little bit of range to it. Oh, maybe not. It's actually a short hunting rifle. Stealth Commando is my build. Good shot. Good hit. <laughs> Another one bites the dust. Get over there, dude. Oh, it dug under. Okay, I mean, that makes sense. I wasn't ready for that. <laughs> So we got the family here. Let's go see what they got to say about these bandits. So my question is, guys, when it comes to these perks, right? Can you, like, respec? Like, I could just level up whatever ones I want. Sounds like the family's still up and running, at least. Try anything, are you? There's kids here. Okay, so they got a whole settlement going here. It's a nice spot, man. Look at this. It's got character. I like. I would. I, I would make my camp look like this. Not supposed to talk to people like you. I'm, I'm a hero. Unclaimed space up the road. Maybe you should give it a visit. Try. 
trying to let you know you're trespassing. Free to leave whenever you like. Treasure. Nothing but trouble. We'd hope to start new lives here. Private ones. So much for that. Just like everyone else. Except we like our privacy. It's not very nice. West Virginia, no. Don't know anything about them. Now I'd like you to leave. Come on, bro. No, 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 no. Look, we worked out a deal with them. Supplies for protection. We can work out one with you. What do you want to know? Once a month, food, ammo, scrap. Murray and me take it up to the mill ourselves. Gave us a password to get in. Blue Danube. Okay, so now we got a password to get in. Plenty. A dozen, minimum. They don't let us in the main building, so I can't say how many were camped out in there. Bunch of cons from back east. They're not crazy, though. Not like the Blood Eagles or the Scorch, say. You can reason with them. They don't know how to farm or hunt. We do. So we worked out a deal. You have something you can offer them? You probably can, too. Okay, so maybe we won't just go and shoot and... I don't know. I still haven't. I still haven't thought. Oh, I'm gonna kill these guys. You can start giving those supplies to me instead. I'm not gonna say that. I'm not gonna be a savage. By all means, beat it. Unless there's something else. Fine. Make it quick. Then by all means, beat it. Unless there's something else. Bye. Dude's rude as shit, man. I'm not I'm not even gonna lie. I'm gonna take your freaking pork and beans, you asshole. Let's go check out and see what the scrapper has to say. So we got the password to get into the gate. We got a campaign hat. Got campaign cover, baby. Let's rock that. Oh, can I not wear it? Oh, there we go. So it's separate. There's armor and then apparel. They're two different... Two different things. There it is. Now we're looking like Smokey the Bear. Like a ranger from uh, New Vegas. So these are weak feral ghouls. A bunch of them, too. Gotta get used to the blocking. I don't know how to use vats. I don't know what the button is. 
Alright, that's just a settler. Probably just look it up, right? Trolls, bats, 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 Pretty sure it was the, that's the same button in uh, Fallout 4. Well, this axe hits different, man. Only problem with it, like I said, the attack speed is quite slow. So we're looking for the uh, like the amusement park or something. There's a Ferris wheel, so I'm assuming it's an amusement park of something of some sort. I want to thank all the new subscribers to the channel too, guys. There's been so many of you coming out, showing so much love. Um, I really appreciate everybody, and welcome to the channel. Uh, again, I, I do appreciate those of you guys who brought the game to my attention and you know kind of nudged me to play it and to not listen to the feedback. And uh, I'm really really happy I did. And hopefully this shed some light to some of you guys, too, that, you know, didn't even give the game a chance because you just heard the bad feedback like I did. Um, I said, fall games aren't for everybody, but if you enjoyed fall, I mean, this feels like a pretty damn good fall game to me so far. And from what people are saying in the chat, it just gets better and better as you go along, so... Now, um, with this going forward... Like I said, I might open up a server or, or do my own, like, friend server or something like that and allow some of you guys to come in and play on it, too. Uh... Oh, let's do... Whoa! Did he just go invisible or was that a glitch? Hey! Oh! Yo, his armor looks so fire, dude! I want it, bro! He did go invisible. That's sick as hell, man. Alright. I don't know, that looked like didn't that look like the Chinese stealth armor? Alright, so there's county fairgrounds. You know what weapon I wanna try actually? I wanna try the knife. See if it's faster, because like I said, this axe hits really, really hard. But the problem with it is, um, it's very slow. Damn, yeah, that shit's fast. Oh, shit! I thought they were just feral ghouls. So what is the difference between the scorched? And, like, feral ghouls. Or ghouls in general.
Dude, this shit actually hits quite hard, this knife. Well, I almost stab the shit out of the, it was a player. Dude, they got suppressors in this one, like in Fallout 4. got a sickle. It had a star next to it. It says medium speed. Did you go invisible, dude? How are they all going invisible? I thought it was that dude's armor. Ammunition vending machine. Okay. okay, so it seems like the guy's up well, on top here. Yep, there he is. What's up, brother? Hiding from the damn ghouls? Jokes on you, don't got nothing. Looking for peace and quiet? Presume those creeps down there would keep everyone else away. <laughs> Guess I was wrong. Yeah, why is everybody so rude? Folks have been doing some building at that track across the way. Uh, you could try your hand at it. Oh, I'd steer clear of the West Virginia lumber up the road. There were a bunch of ogres or whatever up there, but it sounds like someone might have given them the boot. Not sure it's an improvement. At least you could smell the ogres coming. Me? Come here. I'm a science experiment. Broke out of a government lab, trying to decide whether to use my powers for good or evil. Figured I'd have a drink while I... The scent, guys. Ah, uh, you talked to the well-done guy, huh? Well, yeah, I got a little trick up my sleeve. Could kill them all, if I wanted. But I'm not just giving it away. You gotta get me something. Okay. What do you want, dude? Island nearby's got a big nest in it. Bring me an egg? I'll give you what I got. Hmm. Government issued astral transporter. Snagged it on my way out of the lab. Takes your physical form and drops it right into the astral plane. Makes you nearly invisible. 
makes it a whole lot easier to take folks out of this world at the same time. Okay. I, I, I don't... He's not bullshit me, right? I mean, I've seen people go invisible, so maybe he's going to hook me up with some invisibility, guys. If I steal this egg. Makes you invisible, not agile. I can't run so good since I escaped from the government. But I bet you can. Okay. Something nasty enough that I don't want to do it. Up to you, though. If I had level 8 strength, I could just... Force him to give it to me, but... Mind the locals out there. Alright, let's go get the egg, guys. I'm, I'm definitely gonna do it. Where is this little island? Okay, right across the way. Alright, hold on. Before we push out and grab that egg... Yeah, we're definitely gonna grab the egg. Because if he has something that I, I can go invisible, I'm, I'm definitely getting that. Hold on one sec. Yeah, so let's get this egg. Sounds easy enough. Stealth commando build. That's what I'm trying to. That's what I'm. You guys know me. I love my stealth. Definitely would love that. That sounds awesome. So many explosions off in the distance. This is cool, though. If, if we really do get uh, a stealth, something that makes us invisible, you got to think. Like, this is so early game, too. And it, if you didn't do this part of the mission because it's optional, you could have just left. You could have missed out on this, guys. You could have missed out. All I gotta do is steal an egg. Oh shit. Forgot about radiation. Damn it. Oh, we're gonna have to take a little dip in this. Like a chicken egg? No, it's probably gonna be like uh like one of crab people or something. I don't know. I don't know what kind of creatures are even here. I seen the name of the fucking island chat. I seen the name of the island.
Oh. And then we could use right away. Grand X. Now stem up. Want to go invisible, guys? I mean, how hard could oh, I see somebody over there that's who's invisible? I mean, how hard could it be to steal an egg? I don't even see any death claws. Maybe this guy will get spotted by the death claw, and then I can take the egg and just run. Stop making so much fucking noise, dude. Stop it! Run, bitch! Run, bitch! Haha, <laughs> I think the death call's on him! It is! Oh, GG, open world multiplayer, you're awesome. It's just about time to eat. Sorry, dude. <laughs> I got two eggs, I think. Yeah, yeah, I got the egg. I got two of them. Yeah, I mean, I really, I do owe that guy a lot. That death claw probably would have ch chased me down pretty, pretty savagely, but. So much for us killing all the death claws in Fallout 4, right? <laughs> and there being none left. You find me my egg? Now you understand why I didn't want to go. So you get me my egg or not? Well, why do you want a death claw egg? Well, hello. That is a beauty. When you're hatched, you're going to call me most of them. Are you fucking kidding me right now, dude? I just did all that? And this man just gave me some fucking stealth boys? Some stealth boys? I should kill you. Thought he was gonna make me invisible, chat. Like, like, yeah, stealth boys make you invisible. I want it to be really invisible, though. Like, secret armor type. What is this? Tyler Country Dirt Track. Somebody claimed? I, I don't know what that means. All right, let's go. I mean... Better than no stealth, boy, or, or, you know, no stealth, but still, it's... I 
I don't even remember how to use. No, no, don't. Just trying to. I was trying to see if you could hotkey him. Oh, we got a pit boy light. Well, now I got two stealth boys. All right, so we'll take 81. Uh, you can get more XP if you're in a casual team with other players. Yeah, but then I'll feel obligated. I don't remember what button it was to bring up the favorites menu. There we go, F. Somebody's camp. I mean, it's a camp. Almost at a lumber mill. Got some scorched in the road here. So I got the passcode to get in. I don't know how I want to approach this yet. Is that a shotgun I just got? Yeah, but he's got a freaking pump action shotgun. Yo, we're getting all types of guns early on, guys. It says I can't use it. Oh, you gotta be level five. Okay. Oh, that's the um, menu there for the emotes. Is there a way to holster your weapons or does it not matter in this game? Like if I walk up there with this knife in my hand, they're not going to like be pissed. Okay, so they're not, they're not, um, hold R. There we go.
Whoa, whoa. You checked in yet? No one's allowed in without the boss's say so. Use the intercom. What? Oh, yeah? What's the password? Shit. It was blue. Da yeah, Dano. Yeah. Go on through. Yeah, that worked. Go on through. Hoping that this goes smooth, guys. Here we go. None of these guys are the boss. Might be downstairs. You looking for trouble? You're about to find it. I'm sorry. Are you the boss? Hey, Gen Pop. I smell? Washed these clothes like three times. Still think they reek of mutant blood. What's my favorite Fallout weapon? Um, we need no one's heard from Bat. Suspect he finally managed to get himself killed. Right <laughs> Bat was a long shot can. anyway. I always figured it'd take someone coloring with a full Ooh, box of crayons to find us our prize. Out. We had the 50 cal converted sniper rifle from Fallout 4 with a suppressor. It was, it was, it was, it was good. Uh, Gauss rifle. Was pretty nasty too in Fallout 4. Okay, here's the boss. Okay, so he's got Jackie here. Let's try to keep this calm, cool, and collected. You the one with the password? I presume someone gave it to you because they thought you could be useful. Name's Roper. Now, explain to me why the hell you're taking up my hair. I hadn't realized I was looking so much like a milk carton. Unless you've got real business, I suggest you get the hell out of here. Mm. Is that so? And why exactly would I do that? Now what? I wonder if I join the crew. I got two options right now, guys. I join them or I fight them. You know what I mean? But then if I join them, I wonder if that's going to go against working for Waylord. Or Wayward. Just a little band of friends, working together for the common good. Our 
common good. We call ourselves the Free Radicals, because that's what we are. Free. Now, you have any other time wasters you wanted to throw at me? And I want a diamond-studded vertebrate. So I guess that means we're both left wanting something. Explain to me why you should get yours. <laughs> oh, never mind. I want a diamond studded vertebrae. Damn. We went and grinded out some levels. I could come back and, and do these. I don't need dangerous people. I have dangerous people. What I need is someone capable. I presume you've heard about this treasure of cranes? Find that for me and you can join. Rumor I heard is, it's survival is Shangri-La. Whole storehouse filled with food, ammo, guns, medicine. Don't have to worry where your next meal's coming from. Or if your hair is going to start falling out from drinking from the wrong well. <laughs> Make whoever found it a real presence in the neighborhood. I wonder if I do this if he'll leave Wayward alone. That's the spirit. Now get. Found my treasure yet? Chop, chop. Okay. What's short pump action shoddy? This guy's got some. Oh, a stealth boy. Shoddy shells. Some good stuff right here. Wasn't in a position to try to fight this guy right now. So I'd have to I'd have to kill a lot of guys to get out of here. Plus, who knows? Maybe they'll be useful to us. Maybe they'll be useful. So we gotta head back to Duchess. Figure out what the hell's going on with this treasure. If she had. Whoa. Whose is this? Remove high level pyro armor pieces. To could be yours <laughs> it won't let me it says uh i try to enter it it says remove high level power armor pieces to use this power armor frame oh yeah it doesn't have the core in the back there take these Issue is that I'm overweight, guys. Let me see. Is there a weapon workbench here somewhere?
Yeah, I mean, we got a free frame, a free power armor frame. I was trying to see if there was a workbench in this building somewhere. Right, right. Is this it? You think you're gonna yep. bring this treasure in before me? Like hell you are. Let's grab all of that. This one's in better condition. I'm going to scrap this one. Then we got two of the shoddies here. Both level five, though. I'll scrap the worst one. Okay, so now I got a little bit of inventory. Bother someone else. You find pieces to create your own? Yeah, so I didn't know if I should like try to snag the snag some of these pieces, you know what I mean? Or, like it's power armor. It's just sitting here, you know. This is just a frame, though. Should be a fusion core inside a generator. I'll check it. I mean, I could still bring this to my camp, right? And and store it there. How do you store, like, your power armor and shit? Like, where do you store it? Would you store it at, like, your camp? Testing, what's up, brother? How you doing? It's going good, man. It's going good. There's nothing in there. Check uh, your inventory. The armor pieces are in the armor section. Yeah, I can't equip them, though. It, it says, uh... Gotta be level 15 in order to wear these. But I can, I can walk around in the frame. That's about it right now. So I was gonna stash this at my base. I don't know if it'll stay at my base, but... I, I could sell those parts though, right? The power armor parts? Could probably sell them. Yeah, beeping is quite frustrating.
Oh, you can collect it. Uh, okay, so you can just pick it up. Got it. We'll be recrawled in your inventory if you leave the area. Just... So you can just pick it up, guys. Yeah, you can just pick it up. Whoa, who the fuck are those? Oh, those are super mutants. Shit, shit, shit. I gotta get I gotta get back to my my little camp. Now I don't think I'm gonna be out of fast travel because I'm overweight, right? Oh yeah, so I'm over encumbered, so I can't fast travel. Oh, I could okay, so I could put the pieces on it. Yeah, now it won't let me pick it up because it's too um it's it's quote unquote too high high level when you when I do that. Yeah, so we So does the does the power armor chassis by itself increase your carrying capacity? Like let me see. Oh yeah, okay, so now I can fast travel. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, that, the frame is nice, guys. I mean, it's, it's not nice, because it's beeping and has no armor or anything, but we just got ourselves a free power armor frame. Actually, why did I come back here? I need to go back to town real quick to sell two caps. Okay. Now, I got a question, guys. Are all of the stash boxes co connected in the game? For instance, um, the overseer's camp here has this stash box. here if I stash in here will it okay cool so I'm gonna stash up some stuff right now well, actually let me, let me go sell some stuff real quick and then we'll Duchess is damn lucky you showed up with me. You're back. I would you like to do a commando build. I don't know how to do I don't understand how the builds work yet. I worked out a deal with them. Uh we just have to tell them where the treasure is. Oh, is that all? <laughs> I guess I should have specified how I would have liked this to be resolved. I suppose it's on both our heads to find this treasure then. But you did good. Shows maybe you could be trusted. Maybe. 
But there's still the issue of my missing muscle. They went out chasing some unsavory characters. Never came back. They're two of the tougher cookies I've met in my day. So them being gone this long means something happened. You track them down? Maybe I remember a thing or two about this crane fella. Okay. Music to my ears. Missing person number one's named Polly. Got a transmitter in her. You could track her with your little radio there. Missing person number two goes by Saul. Those two are closer than toes and bad stilettos. So if you find one, the other's likely close by. Find them for me, and I'll pay you for the privilege of getting to yell at them in person. Appreciate it. Polly's tracking frequency is 99.7. The once proud home of Appalachia's smooth jazz. I figured someone should get some use out of it. Find out what happened to him. If I need to find new people, I'd like to at least ensure I tried to do right by the old ones. Okay, so I want to trade with her. Alright, let's start by selling. She's Damn, she's only got 1400 but It's not like stuff sells for all that much. I'll keep the grenades, sell the mines. I'm gonna stash some of these extra weapons. Uh, damn, this shit doesn't sell for anything, man. Three caps? Oh, man. Doesn't sell for anything, man. And guys, I do want to thank. We got over 800 likes on this. That's absolutely mind blowing. Um, build your camp at, and make water farm for quick starter caps. Duchess, let you try one of her nice. drams yet? At level five. Let me go. Let me go store up this stuff. Oh, what is that dude wearing? He's wearing like a goat costume. Oh, oh yeah, I can actually use the shotgun now. Okay, so I'll keep those weapons on me. We've got a melee weapon. We've got some grenades, our pistol, rifle, and then we'll try out the shotgun too. Drop this chassis in there. So we got a decent bit of food and drink, boiled water. Actually gives us rads. I had the I had purified water, right? Yep, here we go. So I'm gonna keep my purified water on me, and then for food. We got the Salisbury steaks we could eat. I want stuff that's not gonna give me rads. Okay, we'll keep all that on us. Alright, let's 
scrap all this junk. Armigel with the gifted. Thank you so much. And Mr. DeMarc dropping the five gifted. Guys, I really appreciate the love. Hey, everybody uh, who uh, got one of those memberships, welcome to the family. Uh, make sure you get those hearts in the chat. Okay, so now I got to figure out where uh, Jangles got lost at the fair. So... Do I got to switch over to the frequency? Turn your Pip-Boy radio to transmitter signal to track the guards. That's what I thought. Uh, you've reached level five. Disable pacifist mode in game settings to enable player combat. Oh, shit. Sure. I don't know which one of these I want. None of them really are a decent stealth perk. So we can use this just in case of an emergency right now. Okay, so we got two points in agility. I wish I freaking... Now, do you want to scrap this card for two perk coins? Coins are used to rank up legendary perk cards. Sure. Yeah, we just got to get more cards, I think. So how do you get cards, guys? Mr. DeMarc, no way, brother. Dropping another 10 gifted on the channel, dude. Seriously, thank you so much. Leveling up gives you gets you cards. Okay. Oh, you get cards by leveling. So I see you guys talking about joining the casual group. I don't... What does that mean? Um... Okay. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Stop it. Um... Where do I do that at? I, 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 I want to play solo. I don't really want to play with other people, so that's why I'm not really trying to join a group right now. Oh, so you could still play so solo, but you just... Let's 
see. So you just join the group and then I just continue doing what I was doing? Okay. Works out, works for me. Guys in my group is a level 570, so there's no level cap in this game. Where Okay, so where is So how do I use the signal? Okay. Got it. You got it. You have to have it open if you're going to. We're in the area now. Mr. DeMarc, seriously, brother, what is going on, man? I really appreciate you out here showing the love, man. Dropping another five gifted on the channel. Seriously, brother, thank you so much. I'm trying to... F I think this might be out of the, the zone. Yeah, so it's over in here some... Is that thing really trying to kill the cat? It did kill the cat. George, man, guys, you don't have to do that, man. You guys are out of control today. George dropped another five, man. Thank you. Ooh. So it's an ash pile here, guys. Either A, her muscle disintegrated these guys into ash. Am I supposed to follow the line of bodies?
So it seemed like the line of bodies went down towards that building down there, but... Was there humans down there? I didn't see any. I... So that's a scorched... Scor oh, here we go. So we gotta search the the mine. It's right down the road here. A lot of bodies here. Oh, that said 10 millimeter plus. What is that? Well, I didn't know if it had a, a mod or something on it. I don't think it does. Army Gal with the gifted. Guys, thank you so much, man. Oh, we're just trying to spread the love, sir. And uh, hit split at the same time. Oh, you guys are trying to get split. <laughs> I appreciate you all. All right, so we're going to enter solo. It does have a mod. Now, you guys said the Scorched are not ghouls, right? There we go. I seen there was arrows, guys. There was, there's no bow and arrows in, in Fallout, right? There's never bow and arrows. Um, Flashy said there was a crossbow. I don't think there's ever been bow and arrows, though, right? Shit. Oh, there is bow and arrows. Oh. Was there a bow in Fallout 4? Mikus with the five gifted. Thank you so much, man. So 
So we can go straight Stealth Archer, you know, Skyrim status. I mean, even without a suppressor, these guns are working pretty good. Like, the aggroing of the... The baddies isn't too bad when I'm shooting these guns unsuppressed. find coal Stimpak. I'm hurting here. Oh, thank God. Dude. Thank you. The, the you options they give you to there. say in this game are absolutely so, uh, savage. You the cavalry then? Duchess send you to save our tails? Much as I appreciate it, I'm not the one who needs helping right now. See, these uh, scorched things have been harrying the bar. Me and my bot sis Polly got the bright idea to track down their nest and clear them out. But a couple of them got the drop on us before Polly chased them off deeper into the mine. I heard some fighting, but then uh, nothing. I think she's hurt. Look, you've got to find Polly. I can't be the reason she... Look, just find her. Please. It's... Look, when you get Polly back, I'll walk you through every little detail of how I became best friends with the machine. Oh. But first, I need you to save her. You think you can do that for me? So she's not human. Thank you, thank you. Once you've got her, just bring her back to the Wayward. I'll be there. And tell her... Tell her I'm sorry I couldn't be the one to save her. So now we're gonna press deeper into the mine. Dude, this rifle hits pretty good, guys. Obviously, it's not designed for long range, this setup, but. From stealth, it's a one shot for the most part. him into this shoddy.
good. There's a note around here that has the code to the keypad. Cage code. Here we go. Uh, 071990. Oops. Hold on. 071990. Haha. <laughs> Open says me. need an ID card for this. Maybe we'll find one deeper in the, um, deeper in the mine. That's Polly. You are a sight for sore eye. Why is this so, so tiny? Those things didn't get you, huh? You happen to see a young man on your way through, early twenties, rough around the edges, carrying about a bullet's worth of extra lead in him. He's alive? Thank God, that's good to hear. So, what do you say you and I help each other out? You get me back to the wayward, and I'll help you bake to a crisp anything that bothers us on our way out the door. Never met an Assaultron before, huh? Probably for the best. That flashy red pearl in the middle of my face doesn't just complement my scintillating personality. It also happens to fire a multi-gigawatt laser. You pick me up, and give my neck servos a twirl. I'll kick off a blast that would make Oppenheimer quote scripture. So, we blowing this gin joint? Let's do it. That's the ticket. Now, let's... <gasps> you hear that? Sounds like those things have regrouped. How about we make them regret it? On, darling let's make sure these things never bother the wayward again so that, that was the rest of his body This guy's just gonna keep coming. Yeah, we're good. 
was like, I don't know if I should just leave or, you know what I mean? Or are they going to keep respawning or what? Yeah, you got to try. Yeah, I, 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 you have to like reload a bunch of times. Oh, wow. Yeah, I was trying to figure out. I, I was I couldn't get it to shoot at first. I'm like, what the hell is going on? But yeah, you had to like keep spamming the reload button in order to like build up the shot. find that ID card actually hold on that oh, has to be in here right Overweight, though. Oh, well, that's part of a different quest? Okay. Damn. Ammo finally corroded. Wet Cave really did a number on it. I'm not going to be much help now. Back to town. <clears throat> Have I seen the nuke yet? No, I haven't seen anything yet. We literally just started. Um, we're, we're, well, I mean, we've done a couple things. We went to a couple camps and stuff like that. But yeah, we haven't like seen any like cool end game stuff yet. I don't know what you mean. Like, are you talking about like the 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 little nuke launchers? What, what were those called? The big the what were they called? Big boys, or Fat Man, yeah, Fat Man. Is that what you guys are talking about? Sucks when you're overweight like this, uh, drains your AP. Oh, there was a chest in the mine going up that path. Yeah, I'm so overweight right now. I mean, I can't even go back. It's all good. We're, we'll empty out at our uh, camp. And then we'll keep it going. There's a town right there. What is my weight? Yeah, we're like way overweight. So. I want to loot that place out, man.
This M game is repetitive. Yeah, I mean, that's the thing about a lot of MMO style, like games like this, is when you do get into the end game and you've done all the story, you've done all the content, um, the, the games can get quite repetitive. And, and the thing about it is, it's like games like The Division or The Division 2. I'm, I'm not a huge fan of like that end game comment, like re repeating the raids over and over again. I do feel, or just like farming out like legendary sets of gear. Um, I'm not big on that type of stuff either. It's it's more or less I'm in the, I'm in the game for the journey. You know, once I get to end game, I've done all the content, all the stories, all the quests. Um, that's when I'm kind of like, okay, you know, I, I've done everything I needed to do at this point. How do you do the emotes? I forgot. Let's go ahead and uh, we're gonna scrap all junk. Now my ten millimeter that I have here, okay, conditions good. Doesn't look like any of these had mods of any sort. Oh, we are unlocking stuff. Tweaked automatic receiver. Oh, wait, wait. So is it like the more of a gun you break down, the more you learn of said gun, whether it has attachments or not? Okay, I'm picking up what you're putting down, chap. Unlock suppressor, look at that. I wanna try this pipe compensated bolt action rifle, see how good it is. Look at us unlocking stuff. Okay. All right, let's look at modifying. Okay, so I have to have the gunsmith perk though. How the hell do you get that? Where's that from? Cards. Oop, wrong button. Siren. Someone launched a nuke? What do you mean? Check the map.
I didn't, I didn't see anything on the map, guys. It's not a nuke, it's a camp? Okay. I was like, well, what, what do you mean somebody called in a nuke? <laughs> Is it a kill streak perk? All right, let me go finish um, trying to upgrade my guns. Somebody, somebody got their kill streak perk. Still no new grips. I do have, ooh, we could do the large mag. And this one I can craft. I didn't need, uh, ooh, we needed more new aluminum. Aluminum. So we got a high capacity mag on that. So the suppressor that I unlocked must have been for a different gun. Nice. So we get, how much ammo do we hold in this now? 18 rounds? Hell yes. Yeah, I probably got some more stuff I want. I need a store. Uh, Mrs. DeMarc, hey, thank you. Thank you for ha everything. I hope you enjoy your rest of your dinner, man. Back at long last. But where's our girl? Did you find Polly? The robot? Saul was telling me what happened in there. You got a real knack for showing up at the right damn times. Give those degenerates hell. How the hell do I draw Polly's head? Polly. Oh, God. Polly? Whoa. You're not looking so great, darling. Duchess, I'm not feeling great. Friend, why, why don't you sit her down? Um, Jug should do the trick. This is real snug. That's not gonna do at all. Oh, Polly. This is all my fault. Solomon, no. Don't you dare. This is not... Uh, Duchess, tell me you emptied this out. Did I? You know, I'm 80%. Duchess? It's all right. I, I can fix this. There's a robotics shop over in Somersville that... Oh. Oh, oh. Solomon, you're going nowhere. Look. I'm sorry to even ask, but is there any chance you might be able to help us out here? I can make it worth your while. Find Polly this new body. I'll tell you everything I know How about is he doing? Crane and his treasure. Please say yes. Honey, it's complicated, but I promise. I will walk you through every gory detail if you do this for us. Solomon, you had a spot in mind? Yeah, yeah. Uh, there's this old robotics dealer over in Somersville. Duncan and Duncan. The, uh, the owners boarded it up, but it's possible to get back there if... 
if you know where to push. Oh, don't you worry there. Saul, you still got one of those trackers? Uh, uh-huh. You tag the body with Saul's tracker here, I'll have my people collect it. Once it's safe. All right, sounds good. You are a lifesaver. Here, the tracker. Just plant that on Polly's new frame, and we'll handle it from there. And here, you'll need this to get into the place. Just leave it unlocked so we can come and get the body later. And make sure it's pristine. No damage, no reprogramming. Factory defaults only. I don't want anything going wrong in the transfer. And at the risk of sounding like a broken record, thank you. We'll all owe you big after this. Now I got a question, guys, because it seems like I just got another pack of cards. It's like a booster pack, guys. Now, that's my question. Are these like booster packs, RNG, or are they set cards that you get at certain levels? You have unopened perk pack. Set RNG, RNG. I see some. I see. You get them at set levels. Booster pack time. Okay, so we did get one here for um, for bows. Your bows and crossbows ignore 12% armor. So, I got a question, guys. To get higher level weapons, do I have to craft them myself? Because I'm... I, I, that's what I should have been checking, actually, is the level of the guns. So are, are guns like different level? Yeah, obviously guns are different levels. Like I have a level one 10 millimeter pistol. I could kill somebody who drops like a level five or is that not how it works? Shit. So the, some of those 10 millimeters that I broke down could have been freaking better than the one I have. <clears throat> well, now I now I know, right? Is there a gun level cap? See, I can only craft pipe guns. That sucks. Okay, so where the hell is this mission at? Mine coal in there? No. Okay, it's over here. Yeah, I'm going to keep my eyes open going forward for a... Uh, for a better 10 millimeter. Because, yeah, I didn't even... I didn't even think about it. Like, I was just picking up those guns and I just scrapped all of them. And they, they were probably a way higher, like level one, my, this is level one, this is level one. My shoddy is level five, but. We'll keep our eyes open for higher level guns now. Blueprints unlock new guns. I also gotta make sure, yeah, I gotta check and make sure I'm not picking up any blueprints. Oh, right here, like plan hunting rifle. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. So I did, I had to plan for a hunting rifle in my inventory.
Get right here, machined guns. Um, see, crafting this though, it's only going to be a level one, right? Select it. Okay, I, I see it. You could change the levels. Got it. So let's do a level five. Now we got our level five here. All right, so now I, and now I got an idea of how this is going to work. And this level 5 uh, pipe bolt action rifle, too. So we unlock short scopes. I want to see about uh, modifying this now. Okay, so we can we can throw the long barrel on it. Turn it into a legitimate rifle. Okay, so I, I can't get the full stock though. I need gunsmith for that. I wonder how that weird this thing's gonna shoot with <laughs> with the the handle like that. Oh, we can do a short scope. It looks dumb as shit, but hey, it is what it is. Oh man, my food and water is real low. I did. So what do you just? Boom. Yep, it's as simple as that. So we're gonna head up, down, and around. Uh, I'm gonna hit the highway here, and then we'll take uh, 86B across. So what happens if you run out of water? Do you like start taking damage and shit? down this way that way we can hit the road not anymore food and water are only bus now oh, that's weird what it used to it used to be like that like you would take damage and if you didn't eat and drink I think that's a good system I don't know why why would they change that maybe people complained all right, this is our turn here. People didn't like this four survival system, maybe. Uh, if you check the daily slash weekly challenges, you can earn score points and unlock free stuff on the season scoreboard, like perk cards, consumables, and skins. I mean, I'm happy with this rifle too right now, guys. We got a relatively long range rifle now. Uh, 
That's what's happened in the scum. What do you mean? Scum is a survival game. Like, how could they? <laughs> how could they change that? It's a pretty cool town. Here we got some blood eagles here. a miss I think I just got a snub nose 44 revolver, did it say? Yep. Sure enough. I had a really cool outfit on. I don't understand some of these shots. Like I'm trying to, I, I probably should just aim center mass and try to, instead of trying to aim for the head. I played, yeah, on the channel, we played Fallout um, 3, 4, and New Vegas.
You could area, but then it brings up like this menu here. Like, that was the only reason why I wasn't doing it, but I probably could just area loot. Uh, Sabrina with the 19 months. Thank you, thank you. Dogs need to hide if you're playing Fallout. Get out of here. I've, I've, See what had happened was is 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 different, you know, like it's different this time. There's no dog companions. I mean, I did kill it. Oh shit! Not what I wanted to do. Accidentally used a stealth boy, guys. See, I found some more arrows. Yo, how do you get a bow? I just gotta loot one? Thought I'd be able to craft one of those, like, early on, you know what I mean? It's just a bow. Yeah, I'm overweight again, man. Yo, it's so easy to get overweight in this game, dude. How did I end up with 30 damn shotguns all of a sudden? I'm gonna have to drop some of this stuff, guys, and just... Got that perk point I need to use too. Non automatic pistols do. So, what's considered an automatic pistol is the. Anything. I'll take it that the uh, 10 millimeters considered automatic. I could check it right now. It doesn't say necessarily. It says 10 millimeter capacity range. Okay. So I just wanted to make sure if I use this perk, it was going to apply to my 10 millimeter that's 10 percent more damage all 
Remember if I'm power armor in one of these in the back in, in the back of one of those in uh, Fallout 4? Forgot you had to actually choose the What is this? How did I get that? Buying and selling make your targets receive 7% more damage for 7 seconds after you attack. It's level 46. So does that mean I can't use that till I'm level 46? So what does it mean by two unused points, guys? What? Oh, these things, right? But I can only have one perk at a time. And then you need multiple of the same card in order to, um... Yeah, I think you could take... Investigate the trailer. I'll check that later. And then if I if, if if I take the card back, I get the points back, right? What's there? What's that? That little robot scared the shit out of me, man. You can apply that many more cards. Oh, and they stat. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I see, I see. Oh, so it turns into... Why don't you guys say it turns into, like, a... I would have understood if you were like, yeah, it's like Solitaire, bro. Like, the cards stack like Solitaire. Then I'd have been like, oh, okay. I thought you could only have one card at a time active. You guys gotta remember, I'm a, I'm a fucking Marine, all right? You gotta break it down Barney style or don't break it down at all, all right? If you're not breaking it down Barney style, don't expect me to understand what you're trying to say. You should have, if, so, if somebody was like, yo, like solitaire, I'd have been like, got it, bro. Got it. I don't think I have any more points available though. I used, yeah, I used all my points.
There's the bridge. Thunder? Or... Whoa! Whoa! So the cars are just as dangerous in this game as they were in the fucking Fallout 4, dude. Like little mini nukes. Oh, Charles, brother, with the huge super chat, man. Thank you, thank you. Sorry for not being here as of late. Been working a crap ton of hours. Anyway, here is a little something for ya. Brother, listen. Underscore sway. Hey, man, you never have to apologize for that. I, you know I appreciate you being here, period, dude. Um, So thank you so much uh, for, you know, for even finding some time to come hang out, man. I appreciate the super chat, brother. I at least hope work is going good, man. It was you. It was you. You made the big explosion. Okay, here we go. Duncan and Duncan Robotics. Do I like this game? This game is fire, man. Shit. Of course it couldn't be that simple. Charles, again, thank you for... I have a great rest of your day at work, man. Uh, get that Ragstad meat for more carry weight. Oh, I forgot about that buff. There's, hopefully there's another way in because I can't get into the robotic store that way. Let me check uh, the back here. We got a blood. And homie went up there with a suppressed gun. Maybe we get him through the roof? to the roof. Oh, it's found a double barrel shotty. Okay, so the only other thing I could think, games like this, I'm, you know, I'm looking at like, the thing I like Skyrim. When you were trying to find 
overweight again, dude. We're probably might be in like their house or something. Maybe we gotta try to find a house that has the damn key card in it. Definitely need to find a key card. Bro, don't do it. Oh, you need me for the blood eagles. I'm gonna go check the door again to see if there was like a clue, a note, something maybe left there. Duncan and Duncan Robotics. Tears of the Kingdom? Rick, I've never heard of that. Attention citizens, nuclear strike imminent. Please exit the area at your earliest convenience. What? Thank you for your cooperation. Where is it? Where's the nuclear strike? Okay. Whew. Players can actually call in nukes, guys. Seriously? Yeah, this game has PvP. If you wanted to. I think I'll be able to see the explosion from here. Too far away. Oh no, it says time to nuke touchdown. We got one minute. How expensive is it to, to use and call in a nuke? Uh, Brian Lynn, I appreciate that. And welcome to the live. We're just, um, I'm trying to see if we can see a nuke. That'd be pretty cool. I don't know. We might be too far away. It might not render it or whatnot. 
And it might be on the other side of them. I don't know how big they are, how little they are. Two. One. Oh, you could see it. about PvP, man. That's the ultimate PvP flex. <laughs> oh, it's not PvP, so you can't call it in on a player? Oh, you can call it in on a player. All right, let me see. So we need a key card, obviously, to get in here, but I was trying to see if there was maybe a note, some information. To tell us where we could potentially even get the key card? I'm not seeing it though. Probably gonna have to venture around the town. Unless I didn't... I should have the thing to open it? I know I got the transmitter, but I never got a key card. Maybe it is, yeah, maybe it is lying at the bar. I could fast travel back here now though, right? But if, if I had the key on my key ring, I feel like it would uh, I would have been able to open it, but I wasn't able to, so. Rubens. Oh, I do have it. Yeah, Duncan and Duncan's entrance card. So why the hell won't it work? Guys, I, I do want to thank you. Got almost a thousand likes on this. Uh, definitely going to be an episode two for sure. It w yeah, it doesn't let you equip it. I haven't dunked the Duncan yet. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm literally pressing E on the car reader, guys, and it's, it's, it's not doing it. All 
Uh, I wonder if it's because of my team. Oh, let me log out. I don't know if it's maybe because I'm in the group. You think? I wonder if it's... Oh, so you could do a pri... Oh, so this is the thing, right? Uh, we got adventure, max 24 players, and you have private adventure, which is max 8 players, which is where I can invite you guys to come and play. I don't know what any of this is. So, if you... If, that's if you guys were wondering, if you wanted to play, like, solo and stuff, you could do your own private server. Level one pistol is not doing it, guys. Whoa! See, I didn't have to worry about this last time because that dude had cleared out the town. There it is. First try. Oh. Well now. What do we have here? Are you another ghost? I cannot bring you the peace you require, spirit. Leave me be. So I thought. No need to put on airs with me. I understand your plight, spirit. My name's Skinner, and I am trapped in here, much like you are trapped in undeath. Now, what do you require to leave me alone? I'm pretending to be a ghost, guys. I knew it. Well, spirit. Unfortunately, Assaultrons are military-grade hardware. As such, all of our machines have already been spoken for. Outstanding deal with the United States military just waiting for pickup. You understand. You? You're a Duncan? Hmm. I perhaps see some... Distant resemblance, spirit. But, Mr. Duncan, why, they tan my hide if I gave away an Assaultron. Here, you may take the Protectron. You can find it in the adjacent room. It was slated for one of the lesser clans in the region. The Garahans, or some such. Mr. Duncan, I'm sure, would be thrilled to keep it in the family. I'm sorry, but I simply cannot. The price of such a machine, even before its noted uptick in demand, was in millions of dollars. Bottle caps? Actual trash? Hmm. 
Then it's likely safe to presume the amount you'd need to offer is in the mid-10 figure. Uh, not for purchase, no. The mint condition protectron and handy bodies we have on the premises have been spoken for. And our resupplier is already desperately late with our latest shipment. I do hope you understand. Okay, so it's, I, it's, I can use the pristine protectron. By all means. Pick my way into that. Yeah, I, I can't pick my way through the door. It says I need a lock picking level one. But I haven't been able to, to upgrade lock picking. I don't even know how to. I haven't got a lock picking card, I don't think. Am I going to have to savagely kill this robot, dude? And just take the key card off him? Yeah, you, you got to get the key, unless it's... I heard some screaming outside the window. Do the ghosts rule the outside world as well now? Unless the key card is in here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Aha. So we just got our hands on some keys. Showroom is for customers only. He's pissed. That's not the assault tron, right? That's the Now, Assaultrons are like the battle droids.
truly done it this time, Jonathan. This numeric obsession of yours will be our ruin. You've reminded me multiple times it's the only house in the city with that number. But leveraging our only... You what? Oh, don't be a... Fine. Skinner! I yes, Mr. Duncan. Oh, my brother refuses to continue our discussion without his evening tea. Because he is a petulant child. Do fetch him some so we can be done with this. Mr. Duncan, I hardly mean to be rude, but where exactly would you like me to bring this tea? To my brother, you imbecile. Your brother? At the cemetery. What on earth are you talking about? Go downstairs, make his tea, and bring it to the desk directly in front of you where he is seated. Uh, sir, there's no one there. Oh, oh fuck, it's stuck like Chuck. See him? No, sir. Well, that simply won't do. Skinner, fetch my toolkit. You're clearly malfunctioning. Very well, uh, sir. Unfortunately, the other Mr. Duncan continues to elude us. Are you sure he's not? Hmm. Can we go check that residence and potentially get a key? anyways hopefully that little robot downstairs doesn't have like a combat mode changed uh, the code to the assault trend shirt you have to make so. Okay, so the code is just a bunch of eights. Okay, how do we shut this shit down? Well, I could probably stick the track around it through the hole in the wall. There it is. All right, now that's their problem. All right, let's see if this robot gets aggro. Excuse me. Entrance into the showroom is for customers only. If I encounter any damage in those showrooms, you should expect a bill. He's pretty chill. Try the Far Cry custom maps. I made a ton of... Yeah, let's see. I've never looked into any of that. Put 
about those camps. Damn it. How much am I over? Alright, so I'll drop both of these. have on me that weighs so much. There ain't nothing good out here. Has to be the junk. I gotta have some super uh, we'll drop that. Bulk wood. The extinguisher at six pounds. There we go. I'm gonna do it. When their backs are turned, I swear I'll do it. Yeah, tons of Oh, is it because there's enemies around that it's got a countdown for the fast travel? Uh, how does the game feel as a single player experience? Like a normal Fallout game, George. Yeah, I haven't, I haven't noticed anything different. Uh, feels like Fallout to me. Seriously, it's 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 good. Uh, there's a couple systems that you know you just gotta kind of take a little time and try to learn because it's a little confusing, like the perks and stuff like that, the weapon uh, upgrade level, like weapon levels and things. But other than that, no, it's it, it, it's good. Uh, I'm really enjoying it. All right, guys, but we are going to end it here. We hit over a thousand likes on the live, which is we haven't had that in a, in, in a little bit, guys. So um, thank you. I, I really do appreciate the support. I appreciate all the new subscribers to the channel. Uh, remember, if you guys don't want this to be a series and you want to see more of it, hey, just smash that like button. Uh, we're definitely going to be doing another episode here in the next couple of days. Um, so, again, thank you. I, I'm really, really happy that we actually gave this a chance and checked it out because it's it's dope, guys. It's 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 really cool. I'm I'm just excited to see how much more there is. So I'm pretty sure we barely even scratched the surface of this game. <laughs> All right, but I will be doing another stream here in a little bit. We're gonna be playing some uh, Seven Days to Die. I'm gonna I'm just gonna eat my dinner and then uh, I'll, I'll fire that up. So uh, again, thank you guys. Um, if I don't see you in the next stream, you have a great rest of your night. And for everybody else, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.